Hello, it's Wednesday, November the 3rd, 2010, and I'm Martin Smith with a daily outlook from Maxiforex. The dollar traded mixed against major currencies today. U.S. investors still waiting for the interest rate decision, which is expected unchanged at 0.25%. Dollar momentum is still bearish against most of the major currencies. Stock markets in the U.S. closed with the Dow rising by 0.58% and the Nasdaq advancing by 1.14%. Crude advanced by 1.2% against the dollar and closed at $83.90 a barrel. Gold rose by 0.2% and closed at $1,353.20 an ounce. The euro strengthened against the greenback today after German manufacturing PMI came out 56.60 better than expected 56.10. Holding trade above the support level at 140 will keep the momentum positive for the pair. Overall, the euro dollar traded with a low of 138.81 and a high of 140.58. Today, no economic data is expected. The pound fell against the dollar after construction PMI came out 51.60, worse than the expected 53. Holding the rate above 160 will keep the momentum bullish for the pound. Overall, the pound dollar traded with a low of 159.61 and a high of 160.80. The Japanese yen fell against the dollar and almost reached the 81 resistance level. Traders may use the combination of the American vote and the holiday in Japan to push the pair below 80 yen per dollar. Overall, the dollar yen traded with a low of 80.46 and a high of 80.96. No economic data is expected today. Canada's dollar gained for the fourth day against its U.S. counterpart and had a longer stretch for the last five months. Trading below 100.94 will keep the momentum bearish for the pair. Overall, the dollar CAD traded with a low of 100.79 and a high of 101.35. Today, no economic data is expected. That's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.